Hey everybody, welcome to a crazy impromptu on the fly Facebook Live. Um, I have something super excited that I wanna share with you. We get questions all the time about our Millie Scout services and our scouts are essentially like pounding the pavement as we speak, doing jobs day in, day out. And I wanted to share one of those jobs with you. So if you'll remember, we had Corey Weathers on the show last week to talk about how she was gonna be utilizing the Millie Scout services. And not only that, but tapping into our program that we have launched with Lowe's Home Improvement. Shout out to Lowe's. Uh, Lowe's is sponsoring Millie Scout tasks and assistance for military families this year. Uh, we're gonna be able to provide up to 300 of those tasks free of charge for military families. So Corey's trying that out and she was able to connect with our scout, Nicole, out in Fort Hood. And they are actually on the job right now we're gonna check in with both of them to hear about like what the needs were, what the job was, and how it all went. So pardon the Skype fuzzies, it is what it is, but um, we are super excited to have both of these awesome women on with us. And I'm gonna get real tight. We're gonna squish up really close together on screen. Here we are. Okay, everybody, Whoop, this one, this way. This is Corey, wave Corey, hi. <laughs> Corey's in her car. Corey, what are you doing right now? I am literally out buying lunch for the Packers who are at our house right now and multitasking. I'm dropped my teenager off for a haircut and I'm also practicing with my cat in the car. So oh. <laughs> trying to get the cat ready for the trip too. So it is like a multitasking lunch date is it's what's a happening. hardcore dry run. I love it. So, um, so Corey is headed from Fort Leavenworth to Fort Hood. Texas. Um, and she had two kind of interesting situations come up. Uh, we talked about it last week. I'll link to that episode so you can get the full overview of what's going on with her PCS. But she needed some on the ground help down at Fort Hood, um, which is where Nicole comes in. Hey, Nicole, wave. Hey. Still there? Okay, cool. Yeah, Nicole's got less strong service because she's in a house with no Wi Fi yet. You know, it is what it is. Um, okay, so Corey, tell us a little bit about what uh, the idea behind the job was today. Yeah, so I said when I talked with you before that we ha we are an EFMP family. My son has asthma, and so we're doing the best that we can to do a straight drive from Kansas to Texas without stopping. And so one of the things that we needed in this new house was a refrigerator. And it was really important to my husband that we have a refrigerator put in and ready so that when we got there, we could order groceries and have kind of that opportunity to just kind of lay low and unpack and not have to drive all over town trying to get settled in because my husband has to stay back here in Kansas until they release him. So um, we needed a refrigerator and I knew Lowe's had a refrigerator and I knew you guys are connecting with Lowe's and you have these amazing scouts and I really just needed somebody to be there at the house for the delivery so that we could get it in before we hit the road on Tuesday and try to get there and get settled in. So I reached out to Kelly and, and said, hey, you guys have these amazing scouts. Um, I could use a friend or two out there, but I really don't want to take advantage of all the friends. And when you've got amazing scouts like Nicole, who just really want to help out. And I think it's just a testament to our community. Um, and I know we'll get in. I'd love to share here in just a minute just how amazing Nicole has been and Megan, too. But um, that's the gist of it was that we really needed a refrigerator and we needed it delivered. And Lowe's needed to deliver it today. And so Nicole was available to receive it. And so it's been amazing so far. Awesome. Okay, so Nicole is actually at your house, your brand new house, <laughs> um, which is kind of fun. I've got her standing by a window so she can catch the signal. But um, Nicole, tell us about uh, being able to take the job today. You know, how did that fit into your schedule, your life? I know even there was like a window, right? Because deliveries are the way they are. It's like, oh, we could deliver between any 85 hours of the day. <laughs> right. <laughs> you know notice. So what did that look like for you, Nicole, to be able to work that into your day? Um, they gave a pretty large window, but Corey was able to call me and it, both myself and Megan were like on standby. If one of us couldn't get the job, then Megan would have taken it. Um, there was like a 30 minute window and both of us live close enough away that we could just get in our cars and get here. So I got the, the text message from Corey raced over here and the Lowe's guy kept saying, this is so awesome. You got here right when I got here. Like I pulled up right before you. Uh, and he kept thanking me for being here. And he was asking me about our Millie services as well. So Awesome. Awesome. Yeah. So, okay. Um, I'm going to duck out and I'm going to let you guys pretend like this is like the first you're seeing of it. So Corey, ask Nicole all the questions. Nicole, if you want to show her where the fridge is, how it got set up. 
Um, I really want to see this fridge. <laughs> and she wants to see it. Yeah, let's go open it. Make sure the lights are on, all that good stuff. So I'm going to back out. Um, go ahead, Nicole. Go ahead and like walk her over, kind of walk her through what they did, where it is, if it looks okay to you. Um, basically what we would do at a normal scout job, okay? All right, Nicole, this is all, this is all you, girl. Yes. There we go. And I, I might. <laughs> I want to the kitchen. I'm super excited. And that, you know, how yeah. when you can get, you know, like we've lived in military housing for so long and to have like a new fridge, I'm so excited. <laughs> One that you don't have to clean when you get there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it works. So pretty. So pretty. Oh. Great. And, and I say what was amazing about Nicole um, being on standby and being there first of all um, I mean they were available to me messaging through your Millie system prior to this where we could connect and then when it came closer time to the event I was able to text her and Megan as they were because Megan's going to help me out later we're going to mm -hmm. talk about that later but um, for them to be able to coordinate and they were so responsive. And when Nicole got there, there was like two packages already on my front front porch. So, and I'm not going to be there till Tuesday. So mm -hmm. it means so much to me that she could bring those packages in. She took a picture of the packages on the counter for me to let me know that they were there. Um, the Lowe's um, guy that was delivering and installing the fridge <laughs> full of questions. And so she was able to relay those questions to me and and there really wasn't an issue but he just had a couple questions that honestly she was just amazing to be there to help make it possible so this was a huge like nerve-wracking thing to have a, a major appliance delivered to a house that you can't be at for the next week mm -hmm. and so um, it's really stressful just trying to coordinate all of that and so Thankfully, and of course, Lowe's gave us a great deal on Memorial Day, so that helps a ton too. Right, right. And so that was part of it. Also, Corey, I need to tell you, this is my fridge. I have the same exact fridge. <laughs> As I'm like looking at it, I was like, oh, it's a good fridge. Do you like it? It's a good one. So, yay, that's awesome, you guys. Um, so, Nicole, do you have any feedback on like, you know, it sounds like everything went off really well. Like, I think the key here too is over communicating, right? Like, so it's so funny. We kind of ran into this hiccup where it was like when they extended the delivery window, Corey reaches out. She's like, oh, I hate to like put somebody out like that and have them waiting around all day long. And I'm like, no, no, no. Th this is what's so cool about the scouts is that you're paying them. Yeah. So they they'll take the job as, according to whatever the parameters are that they're interested in taking it with. So it's not that you're putting your friend out for 12 hours to kind of clear their day and wait around on call. You're paying someone to do a service for you. Um, and so Nicole, also, I know you are trying to run cause you've got some kiddos school stuff or online school stuff. So I want to give you the opportunity to just give a quick, um, maybe overview. Like, how did you, how did you feel about this job? How are you feeling about the Lowe's program? Um, maybe like a quick plug for anybody that wants to work with you and then I'll let you jump. Uh, it was, it was great. It was, I, I have my kids in the car, actually. Yeah. I could do this job, this job with my kids in the car. They're just hanging out, having fun in their little, you know, schoolhouse. Play. It's the last day of school here, actually, but their school playhouse on wheels outside. They didn't care that they had to come along with me. Um, this, was, this was great. It was great to help out another military family. And why am I not? Awesome. No, you're good. And y'all, this is so mobile and so, like... <laughs> pushing the boundaries of what I think I'm capable of, of live streaming to you. So if you're watching, you, you got your, you you've been watching long enough, you know, this is kind of how we roll. <laughs> Thank you, Nicole. I'm going to let you go button up the job, tighten up that house, make sure it's locked up and ready to go. And if you and Corey want to communicate afterwards, um, awesome. I want to still grab you for a second though, Corey, if you have time um, to wrap this up. Okay. Thank you, Nicole. Appreciate Thank you. you Nicole. Thank you. Okay. See you later. Okay. Well, that was fun. Like first ever live scout job. That was pretty incredible. How are you feeling, Corey? Any less stressed? Oh, so, so less stressed. Like you said, we were really having a hard time coordinating. And you're right. Um, not coordinating with the scout, coordinating with Lowe's. Mm -hmm. And it's a busy time for them because everything has just kind of opened up in several states. And so trying to coordinate a delivery time with such a huge window. And like you said, I was really kind of feeling bad about like, I, I hate asking somebody to, to be available from eight to eight, right? That's just a crazy amount of time to be available. 
And that would be hard to ask probably somebody else to do. But when it's something that like Lowe's is compensating for their time, like it's, it's just a wonderful feeling to, I have a need that was fulfilled. Um, Lowe's was able to pay Nicole for her time, which makes me feel good too, because I, I get to support another military spouse. And there's something lovely about using our military community this yeah. way. And that's really what, you know, I love the fact that she brought her kids. Like, that's what we do, right? Yeah. Like as military spouses, we help each other out. We understand what it's like to move to a new place and need help that way. And so if you have to bring kids along, then she did. And I was fine with that. And so it really just was the best kind of experience you could have with your community. It's amazing to have your community help you in general, right. but when you have your community help you out and they get compensated for it, I just think that's awesome. Isn't it? it yeah. You feel so much better about the whole thing and the whole process. So um, unbelievably supportive, so responsive. She was just texting me, you know, and coordinating all of this and, and making me feel really comfortable and um, like she wanted to do it and take care of it. And at the same time, um, just so available this morning. Like I, you know, I was worried about like, you know, here's, here's another mom with kids that I got a text and say, I got it like 30 minutes. Like, can yeah, you be there and go <laughs> right. I knew that that was coming. Yeah. But the fact that she was so responsive with her phone and like within seconds was like, I'm on it. You know, it just was great. It was just, was great. I'm so thankful to you guys and Millie and to, um, Nicole and to Lowe's too, for giving us a great fridge and delivering on time. Right. Like that's always yes worry about too and they say they're coming and then it's like three hours later you know but they <laughs> and it was great yeah it's a, and we were all kind of holding our breath we have so much confidence in you Lowe's but we were also like please show up <laughs> I think it's part of the PCS experience right, right. you just kind of hold your breath during every part of the experience yeah. and hope that it's all going to be smooth and so when it is you're like oh okay we've crossed that finish line yeah yeah it's it's been, it's been great to watch. And I've just kind of been like sitting back with my popcorn, like you guys there yet, you guys doing it. Like I can't wait. And there, <laughs> so, um, okay. And then also Corey, really quickly, you're going to have, uh, Nicole, not Nicole, I'm sorry, Megan, our other Megan. scout at Fort Hood help you out next week. So what's that going to look like? Um, yeah. Yeah. So I'm so excited because Meg, Megan, Nicole, and I are all on this group chat now. Um, <laughs> oh, hold on. <laughs> Let me, I'm here. Let me. Okay. I got a call from Matt. Are you there? Yeah. Hey. <laughs> okay. Um, so I have Nicole and Megan that are on um, a group chat because they were both going to be helping me out in this process. And so um, Megan is actually going to help me with household goods delivery. Again, since Matt has to stay here, I could do it by myself. And I think we say that as military mm -hmm. spouses all the time. We say, I could do it by myself. And I do have a teenage son um, but I just knew it was going to be really helpful to have another military spouse that understands, you know, household good delivery stuff happening. And um, just so I'm really excited to have Megan there with me, too. I'm really happy to spend some time with her and to know that I've got another military spouse that understands that day that will be able to be available. Because I actually thought the other day, I mean, here I am right now doing the lunch run for Packers. And when it's time for household goods to do that lunch run for mm -hmm. a truck, I can't, I don't think I would want to leave my kids there yeah. or my stuff there, right? I, I really do need some extra hands. I need to be able to run that errand or do what I need to do. Um, and having another person is going to be great. Yep. Yep. Or she can run the errand for you. I mean, either way, right? It's all the things that you don't think of until you're like, oh, shoot, you know, like, so just yeah. having one other person available to you. Um, is a huge, so I think you're getting up to like two ish, three hours of scout support on the day of. So, awesome. um, yeah, you guys, that's another thing. If you are PCSing by yourself this year, which we know a lot of people are, um, you do not have to just suffer through like, we're here for you. We're here for you. And it's free. <laughs> so, for, for, for go sure. for it, you guys, the link is down here. Well, you know, wherever I'm pointing at the bottom of the screen, we'll post it up in the comments as well. Um, so you can look up more information about how to apply for the free scout uh, services this year um, and keep following along. We'll probably do this again on Tuesday, Corey, as long as your, your move stays scheduled on Tuesday, which you guys is also why we didn't try to schedule and promote this ahead of time because we never knew. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> so just stay tuned. It'll be just like a PCS. <laughs> Corey, thank you so much. Good luck on the rest of your day for your pack out and uh, safe travels when you guys are actually moving. And we'll check in with you again soon. Okay. Thanks, Kelly. Yay. Bye.